What is going on guys? It is L321 here today and today guys I'm going to be showing you how to get way better connection on Xbox Live. So without further ado, let's get straight into this video. So I noticed a lot of you guys did like my tutorial a couple of months ago where I showed you guys how to install digital games a lot faster. If you guys do want to check out that video and you've not seen it before, just go into the description of this video and click the link so you can watch the video. Or you can just go onto my channel and find it, it's pretty easy to find. But today guys, I'm actually going to be showing you how to get better connection on Xbox Live. But I will say before I get into this, it won't work for everyone, but it will work for most people. So yeah guys, just get straight into this, it's easy to do, so yeah. First of all, obviously, we're going to go onto our Xbox One, and we are going to go onto the settings menu. And we're going to go down to where it says network, and we're going to click um, network settings. We're going to see how good our connection actually is at this moment. Some of you guys may know what your stats are on your connection, but if you don't, you're going to go to the section right here, and you're going to click it. And it's going to check your connections. We're just going to wait for this to finish. And it's taking fucking ages. So as you can see, guys, this is the um, stats of my connection. And, you know, try to laugh too much to be possible. I know they're fucking shit. But um, this little technique will really improve your connection. For some people, this will actually double your download speed. For me, my download speed was 5 megabits a second, and it has gone from that to 10, which is pretty darn good. To do this, guys, what we're going to do is we're going to back out, and we are going to go to our advanced settings. We're going to click this, and we're going to go to our DNS settings. And we are going to now click manual, and we are going to input the following DNS settings. So for the primary one, what we're going to type in is 8... 8, 8, 8, and we're going to press the, you know, the enter button. And then we're going to be taken to the secondary one. So we're going to click in 8, 8, 4, 4. And then we're going to click enter again. And what we need to do now, guys, is we're just going to press the B button to, you know, back out. And it's going to recheck the connection. Now, it's up to you at this point whether you want to restart your Xbox. That's probably a good thing to do. If you don't want to, you can't be asked. That's fine. And yeah, guys, you can check your connection again and see the difference between the connection before and after. Come on, you fuck. For me, it actually doubled, although I will say the upload speed didn't actually change, which was kind of strange, but um, yeah, my download speed actually doubled by doing this method, so it worked perfectly well for me. So now you guys are probably thinking, well, this is just the same method I showed you in my how to install digital games a lot faster video, but there is actually an extra step I didn't show in that video, because at the time I had no idea you could actually do this. And this extra step will really make a difference. You're going to need to install this program on screen. And it's completely safe to download, guys. Um, you just download it from the site on screen. The download link will be in the description of this video. Very easy to download and install, guys. Won't take very long. And once you have it installed, what you're going to do is you're going to run the program and it's going to search for the nearest and best DNS codes in your area. And once you've done that, guys, what you can do is go back onto the Xbox One and just input that DNS code. It's as simple as that. And that is the best way to get the best connection on Xbox Live. So guys, if you found this video useful or just a little bit decent, make sure to hit that like button. That would help me out so much. If you guys do have any problems with this at all, let me know in the comments section down below. Make sure to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on the best modding, trolling and gaming content. And I will see you next time. Thank you guys for watching, just click the annotation on screen now to check out my previous video. And don't be a donkey, slap that subscribe button silly, and I'll see you in my next video.